Alright guys, this is my first Game Maker tutorial. Uh, it'll be for main menu. The first thing you want to do is download my assets. That way you don't have to make the buttons or make the background. We're going to make some sprites. So just name them SPR and then what the name of the button is. So the first one will be SPR underscore back. Then we'll make the next button. And this one will be SPR underscore info and we'll make another one and this one will be SPR underscore play and we'll make the last sprite and it is SPR underscore quit now we're going to want to create our background and I have a background in the assets folder so you can just use that I already have it set to the resolution it needs to be now we're gonna create the objects so instead of naming these object underscore we're gonna name them btn underscore for button and we're just gonna make all our buttons and make sure that you link it to the uh, corresponding sprite and just create all of your buttons Make sure they match. This is very important. Make sure they are all BTN. They don't have to be BTN. I just like to make them BTN. Alright. So now we are going to get into the... Um, one moment. Alright. So now we're going to create two rooms you want to close your second room and in your first room let's just maximize it real fast and we're gonna make our quit button we're gonna make our info button and we're gonna make our play button now you can hold control and move these around wherever you want them to be now we are going to do our background so just add in your background it's already set to the correct resolution and that should be done with level one now we're going to get into the actual programming behind this all so what we're going to want to do is create a new uh, event on left click we're going to uh, use a code panel a control we're going to just type in what I type in here it's very simple to understand And the reason why we made our back button is because uh, we're going to use it in the second level. And now just make another uh, event of on a left click. And we're going to put in some programming. Once again, this is in a higher resolution, so you should be able to easily read this. And again, do the same thing, and then look at what I write it makes sense what I'm writing and now do your last button Again, just do what I do. These should be very easy to remember as well. Now we're going to open up our uh, second room and we're going to put in a back button and we can also add our wood background. And now it's pretty much just uh, running our game. Test it, make sure everything works. I didn't add any game info yet, but if I press game info, it should load the info. Close that. If you do play, you'll go to the next level. Back, you'll go to the previous level. And quit, we'll close the program. Well, I hope this tutorial helped. I'll be uploading more.